Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel. I had an interesting uh, experience early on in the week. I had a patient that came in who was really invested into their own sort of welfare, their lifestyle, and was and told me that they'd been recommended that they take finasteride because they wanted to increase their testosterone levels. They really cared about muscle growth and muscle building and wanted to know what I felt about that. So we're gonna unpack that in today's episode, so stick around. Welcome to The Hair Loss Show, where Dr. Russell Knudsen and Dr. Vikram Jayaprakash discuss issues relating to hair loss and the medical and surgical treatment of hair loss in both men and women. Thanks again for watching. Please remember to like and subscribe to the channel. So the question is, if I take finasteride, or should I be taking finasteride if, forget about the hair side of things, I want to increase my testosterone levels? Is that going to be a significant adjunct to be able to do that along with using potentially exogenous testosterone or other sort of supplements as well? And the short answer is probably not. You're not going to get a significant increase uh, of your testosterone levels with by taking finasteride. I understand the theory behind it and the theory being that we have in our bodies testosterone and the normal pathway, the metabolic pathway, and it's part of the steroid pathway of, of breaking down the testosterone. Testosterone can either be broken down into estrogen or it can be broken down into dihydrotestosterone or DHT. And there's an enzyme called the 5-alpha reductase uh, enzyme. There's another enzyme called the aromatase enzyme here, which we're not going to worry about right now. But we're specifically looking at this pathway because if you take finasteride, you block that enzyme. And if you block that enzyme, you block the conversion of that to that, you lower that in the system and therefore increase that. But, uh, and, and so you can see that will increase your, your testosterone levels. But really, it's not going to increase it uh, significantly. And a lot of studies have been done on this using a, a dosage of finasteride of anywhere between a milligram to five milligrams a day, and they've not found a significant increase. There has been a mild increase, but not a significant increase in, in, test, in serum free testosterone levels. Now, and especially if we look at hair, and certainly in the way that Dr. Knudsen or myself would practice, the way we use finasteride is actually at a lower dose. We use low dose finasteride. Sometimes we wouldn't recommend people, uh, patients taking it on a daily basis. And as such, we're not in those individuals gonna see a significant increase in, in testosterone. So using finasteride as a sole therapy to increase your testosterone levels is probably not gonna get you very far. All right, sorry to say that. I hope you found that useful. Thanks again for watching, and we'll see you on the next episode.